Hi everyone, so Christmas is coming. Today I'm gonna make something that look like Christmas cookies, but actually they are not. So let's see how they turn out in the end. Firstly, we peel shrimps and devend them. Next, we cut the shrimps into small pieces and chop them finely. Mix a clove of garlic and chop one spring onion. Then chop everything into a fine paste. You can also use a food processor and process all these ingredients together. Transfer the mixture to a bowl and add 2 teaspoons of tapioca starch, half a teaspoon of salt, 1 teaspoon sugar, half a teaspoon of pepper and mix well. Also add 1 teaspoon of sesame oil and set aside for 15 minutes. Meanwhile, we prepare the bread. Remove the four sides and cut the sandwich bread into four pieces. You can cut them in square shapes or triangle shapes. It's up to you. Here I use cookie cutter to cut them into uh, other shapes that I like. In Vietnam, we don't really have a baking tradition on Christmas, but uh, because I'm living in a country where Christmas atmosphere is so overwhelming, I'm making this um, cookie-like toast to celebrate Christmas. <laughs> Here I have cut um, the sandwich bread into all the shapes that I like two Christmas trees and two lovely hearts You can spread some sesame oil on the table knife to prevent it from sticking and um, spread about one tablespoon of shrimp mixture evenly over each side of bread then smooth the tops Next, uh, we sprinkle sesame seeds on a plate and press the shrimp side lightly into the sesame. up my uh, Christmas trees with uh, sesame seeds. Now we will deep fry the shrimp bread. Heat a generous amount of oil in a pan and fry the shrimp size of the bread about 2 minutes or until gone brown. over and continue to fry the other side. 
When both sides are golden brown, you transfer the toast to paper towels to drain the excess oil. So we are done. Here are our products. My Christmas trees. <laughs> it doesn't look uh, as nice as I wanted it to be, but anyway, it tastes great. The heart shaped ones are okay. Um, you can serve it with um, chili sauce or sweet and sour sauce or whatever sauce that you like. Um, if this is too oily for you, you can toast them in the oven. But I find the fried version is a lot better. You can serve this as a finger food or um, appetizer for your Christmas party. But I think it, all the toast will be gone before the party even starts. So I hope you like it and thank you for watching. Merry Christmas!